Hey friends, Alyssa here with a new video. Sorry it's been a little while, but I wanted to do a little recap of my summer video and a life update of what's going on with me. So, hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> I've had such a wonderful summer. Um, a lot's been happening. I haven't been posting too many YouTube videos as of late, but don't worry guys. For those of you who love that I do Vlogmas, I will be doing Vlogmas again this year, which is a video a day every day for the month of December. So stay tuned for that. But I wanted to do a quick recap of my summer and what I've been doing and what I've been up to. So in June, um, I was here in Oregon. Right now I'm in Oregon. Uh, visiting with Nate and in June I was here we did a lot of camping we spent a lot of time at the river and it was a really really good time uh, really fun and then I went back to Canada and started working on meal plan part two uh, which should be um, ready by November I'm hoping if not by December um, and so Nate came to visit me in Canada and we had a blast. We did a lot of videos in my kitchen. We did some recipe videos and I took him to Jasper, which is my probably my favorite place to go in Canada. And in the mountains, we did some camping. Of course, we did it all raw. And I did a lot of slow motion video uh, of that trip. Um, you can see the uh, video if you click one of the cards or in the description below if you wanted to go check that out but we did a lot of video we spent a lot of time together in Jasper looking at waterfalls and just having a blast together it was really really awesome and we got back we filmed some more videos and then the day after he left I flew to the UK for the UK fruit festival that was amazing I loved attending and speaking at last year's UK Fruit Festival, so I was honored to be asked to return and do some more talks. I love it there, I love it there, I love the people, I love the speakers I spoke with, um, I loved connecting with everybody and seeing old friends, making new ones. It was so amazing and I can't wait for next year. So excited for that. And then after the UK Fruit Fest was over, I flew back to Canada again and I was only home for about two days and then I had to fly to Kelowna. And in Kelowna, uh, we were getting ready for the Canada Fruit Fest. So I stayed with Ted and a bunch of other speakers and other volunteers at his family cabin. Um, and that was absolutely amazing. We had such a blast um, eating fruit and eating a lot of tomatoes. <laughs> Me and Grant ate a lot of tomatoes and tahini. <laughs> so that was really, really fun. Um, we had a great time connecting with each other. Uh, I made some beautiful, amazing friends that will be friends for life during that week. Um, and I'm just so blessed to have been a part of that. And then after that week, we had the Canada Fruit Fest and the Canada Fruit Fest was absolutely amazing as well. Super awesome, more amazing people, a lot of fellow Canadians, which was really awesome that I got to connect with a lot of people who follow me in my own country. So that was awesome. I got to meet Johnny Juicer and Ralvana and Elise from Raw Alignment, um, Absolutely Mel and John Kohler from Growing Your Greens or OK Raw as also. Uh, so many other people and I got to hang out with Doug Graham and really connect on a more friend level which was really, really awesome. So that was such a wonderful trip. Even though it rained, <laughs> that was, it was awesome. And then after the Canada Fruit Festival, me and Nate's mama, my future mama, uh, Live Love Ra, Linda, uh, we drove across Canada to go to Woodstock in New York. So we went all the way from BC to New York um, in six days, we stayed in hotels, we stayed in our tent. <laughs> it was really, really, really fun and I absolutely loved spending that time with her. And that trip is also on my YouTube channel, so if you guys wanted to watch what we ate while we traveled, you are more than welcome to go head on over to my channel and check that out. 
and then was Woodstock. Woodstock in New York, the Woodstock Fruit Festival was absolutely amazing as well. I had so much fun there and that's where Nathan proposed to me and so I'm now his fiance and that was just wonderful that he did it in front of our fruity family and I could share that moment with everybody there too. Um, our friend Constantinos, he got uh, the video of him posing and I have that also up on my YouTube channel if you guys wanted to watch. So that was it for August and then I flew back to Canada at which point I started to work really hard on my meal plan part two, so creating new recipes. Um, a lot of stuff you guys have probably seen on my Insta stories. I've been sharing some of those um, temptations for you guys. And then just about a week ago, I flew back down to Oregon to spend more time with Nate. So that was my summer. It's still really nice here today. Um, it's snowing back in Edmonton and it's almost October. It was snowing when I left. <laughs> but yeah, so that's a life update. Um, we have filed for a fiance visa, so I will be moving to the United States. I will be moving to Oregon, Southern Oregon to be with Nathan and his boys. So that is a big life update that's happening and I'll, of course I'll keep you guys posted on what goes on with that. My meal plan part two again set to release around November, December I'm hoping. Um, in November I do have to go to Mexico and Nathan is coming with me uh, because my friend Maria is getting married so we're gonna go spend some time with her in Mexico and that's gonna be pretty awesome. I'm gonna come back here for Christmas and New Year's and then we'll see what 2019 brings. It's gonna be really awesome. So this again is just a little recap of my summer and a life update video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you did, please click like and subscribe to my channel to get notifications for more. Uh, you can find me on Facebook, Alyssa's Raw Food Romance, on Instagram, at Raw Food Romance, and on Snapchat, Alyssa Raw Vegan. So until the next video guys, fruit on.